Hi everyone, I'm Raksha Gangwal, a data enthusiast and in this video we are going to learn about upsort operation. So what exactly is upsort operation? Upsort operation is a combination of word update and insert. So basically uh, in the context of relational database, an upsort is a database operation that will update an existing row if a specified value already exists in the table. Otherwise it will insert a new row if the specified value doesn't already exist. Okay. So we are going to implement the upsort operation in Databricks environment. Now for that what we are going to do is we are going to import the necessary pa packages first. All the functions and packages are imported. After that what we are going to do is I am creating a schema. So as you can see in the schema variable I have given the struct type and the struct field wherein I have all the column names and the data type. Okay. Based on that I have uh, created a source data. So as you can see in the source data I have have I just have only one row as of now. So like trainee name as Raksha, age, department and so on. Okay. Now once the source data is created the next step is to convert the source data into a data frame. So using this command spark.createDataFrame we will be able to convert this into a data frame. So this is after using the display command this is how the data frame will look like. After that what we are going to do once the data frame is created we are going to create a view out of it. So this is the name of the data frame and based on that I have created a view. The name of the view is source view. Okay. Now we shall see how does it look. So we have given this command. So this is how it looks. Okay. Next step is to create our target table which is the delta table. So what for that we are going to do is we are going to create a table. So as you can see here I have given a name as trainees which is a part of a Raksha DB uh, database. So this is a name of my delta table. Based on that again I have given all the table names with the required data type and given a format using delta and uh, I have given the location where wherever I want to store this delta table. Okay. Now we shall see how does it look. So this is again uh, select asterisk uh, from the delta table. So currently you shall observe that query return no results. Why? Because this is a fresh table and there is no data in that as of now. Okay. So now what we are going to do next is we are going to apply the actual upsort operation. So this is complete. This complete is my upsort operation. So let me explain you. Uh, what we are going to do here is we are applying a condition merge into the delta table. This is just an alias that I want to call my delta table as a target table and my source view as a source. So merge into delta using source based on condition. So this is my condition. That condition is all about my primary key. So here trainee ID is actually acting as a primary key. So when the condition is met and it is matched so uh, it is saying that update the entire set. So you shall see that here when condition is already matched we shall not have any trainee ID in this particular block. Other than this all the columns will be here. So update my target based on source and if it is if, if it doesn't match so then uh, insert all the columns and all the necessary values. So you shall see that uh, we have uh, one row affected and we have inserted one row in the delta table which is the record the Raksha record. Okay. Now this is to confirm how our changes looks like. So again I'm calling my data uh, from the delta table and this is how it looks. Now we'll talk about the next stage in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.